is day one of the 183 day long hurricane season in the Atlantic and it's already started. Alberto showed up earlier this week bringing deadly floods and mud mudslides to the Florida Panhandle and much of the southeast. Yeah, now is the time of course to take important steps to protect your family and your property. News News Deanne Roberts speaking with experts about how you can prepare yourself before a storm hits the low country. It's June 1st, which means it's the first day of hurricane season. So it's time to make sure you have your hurricane kits all packed and ready to go. Those crystal clear skies and sunny Sunday mornings could easily turn into this. Violent winds and what may seem like never ending rain showers because it's hurricane season. Last year, the United States endured 10 hurricanes. These hurricanes form when winds from tropical storms reach 74 miles per hour. But the question this season is, how many hurricanes are we expecting? And who else better to tell us than Storm Team 2's meteorologist Josh Marthers. Right now, in that area where most of our big hurricanes form between Africa and the islands, the water temperatures are at their, really, their farthest from normal in the good way below normal than what we've seen since 1994. But that doesn't mean the coast is clear or the skies. Just because we're seeing those lower water temperatures compared to normal between Africa and the islands and a slightly less favorable environment this year for tropical storm and hurricane development, that does not mean you need to let your guard down. So that means it's time to go packing. Hurricane season 101. Make sure you have supplies ready to go, like non-perishable items, flashlights, batteries, you name it. Keep your gas tanks full in case of an emergency and know your evacuation route. Just because experts expect a below average hurricane season, they want you to remember one thing. It only takes one of those uh, to really mess up your day. So make sure you and your family are prepared for any hurricane because it only takes one. Hurricane season lasts from now until November 30th. Reporting in studio, Deanne Roberts, Count on Two.